Hi everyone, today we will see a problem from projectile motion. So the question goes as, a staircase contains uh, 3 steps each 10 cm high and 20 cm wide. The minimum horizontal velocity of ball rolling off the uppermost plane so as to hit the lowermost plane is. So uh, there's a staircase uh, which is having 3 steps, it is uh, 1, 2 and 3. Um, so we have to find uh, the velocity of a ball which is rolling off the uh, uppermost plane so as to hit the lowermost plane. So the lowermost plane is nothing but the third step and we have to find a uh, u such that it has a minimum value uh, to reach the lowest lowermost plane. That is, uh, it has a minimum value when it uh, crosses uh, two steps itself. So, uh, so this is star one and I mean this is step one and this is step two. The velocity u will be having a minimum value when it crosses the second step itself. So we just have to find a, a u such that it uh, crosses just two steps. Uh, so we know that uh, it is given in the question that uh, each, uh, each star is 20 centimeter wide and 10 centimeter high. So to solve this question, uh, first we have to uh, find the trajectory of the particle. Uh, so let's find the trajectory of the particle using equations of motion. Uh, so to find the trajectory of the particle, let's use the equations of motion. So when the particle is, uh, you know, uh, dropping off from, rolling off from the uppermost plane, it has an initial velocity of u, and even when it reaches the lowermost plane, it it, it will have the same velocity as of u uh, because uh, there is no horizontal acceleration. Hence, the velocity will remain the same. Uh, so the displacement along x direction will be given as x equal to ut, and there is no acceleration, so uh, ut is uh, enough. And for the y direction there is an acceleration but initially there is no uh, vertical uh, velocity so uh, uit would be zero plus half gt square so now we have uh, framed these two equations oh, from these two equations we can find the trajectory of the particle trajectory is nothing but uh, an equation involving x and y so we have to eliminate this t uh, from both of the equations so let this be one and let this be two so t is equal to x by u which is from 1 and let's substitute this in 2 so y is equal to half g x by u the whole square which will give you half g x square by u square so this is the trajectory of the particle involving uh, y and x uh, now we just have to substitute uh, you know the values from this question and uh, let's find the answer um, so as I said in the beginning, uh, to reach the lowermost plane, uh, it's just enough to cross uh, two steps uh, so that the u will be minimum. So x will be equal to um, here. The, this is 20 centimeter wide, and the second step is 20 centimeter wide. So 20 plus 20, 40 centimeter, which is 0.4 meter. And when it uh, along the y direction, it is 10 centimeter. Uh, it is 10 centimeter high. And the next step is also 10 cm high. So 10 plus 10, this will be 20 cm, which will be 0.2 meter. Now we just have to substitute here. So y is 0.2 is equal to half g. x square is nothing but 0.4 into 0.4 divided by u square. We just have to find this u square, I mean u. So u square is equal to half g, 0.4 into 0.4 divided by 0.2. So this will give you 2 and this 2, this 2 will get cancelled and 10, g is nothing but 10 and 0.4 u square. So u square is equal to 4 then u will be root of uh, 4 that will be 2. So the answer will be u is equal to 2 meters.